In this video, I'm gonna show where are the safes of all the houses in Brookhaven. I've also shown a lot of bizarre secrets that these places hide. The first safe that I'm gonna show you guys is not really from a house. It's actually the one from Brookhaven's bank. In this place, we can just give ourselves some money in the honest way. But we are looking for safes. So we gotta go behind the counter and grab this green card right here. Then you just use it on this door that it'll open. And now we are here at our first stop. The first safe we are blowing up today. We just need to go to our inventory and grab the trusty C4. Then you just place it next to it. Explode it and we can grab that money. And that's how you easily become a millionaire in Brookhaven. As a bonus, I'll show you guys that there's a secret passage here so you can make your escape. You see how cool my secret knowledge is? But before I can show all these saves for you guys, I need to see if you guys can leave a like and subscribe to the channel with your pinky finger. And if you can do that, comment potato in the comments below. Let's just use this secret passage to get out. And there we go. Now we have a lot of money and there's no police looking for us. Since in Brookhaven there are a ton of houses, we're gonna be testing them one by one so it's easier. The first safe I'm gonna show is in this house right here. This house has one of the easiest safes to steal from. You just gotta go up here and you'll see it there on the floor. Look at all this money that's going on the floor too. It's one of the easiest for sure. It's not even hidden. Next one is in this house right here. We just gotta go inside all innocent like and go upstairs. Another easy safe. We just gotta find this closet and we'll be face to face with this safe. Now let's get away from here. Thanks for the money sucker. Wait, this is my house. Am I the sucker? Our next safe is in this house or this military hideout. I don't really know. But we're gonna go inside and find out where the safe is. Well, you'll find out. I already know. We gotta go downstairs through this ladder where we'll find these jail cells. Kinda creepy. You can even go inside of them. They even got some handcuffs and a radio on a table nearby. This place is weird. There's some weapons and this sort of supercomputer here. The hidden safe is after you pass through these things on the ground, which kinda look like missiles. As we walk into here, we'll find this secret passage, which is already kinda bizarre. And if we smash our hands on this wall for a little, we'll find another secret in the wall, which is this paper on the ground. Here's a zoom in for those of you interested in this lore. But the actual safe is found right in front of that entrance. Look at it right there. This is one of the harder safes to find, but we ended up with the money anyway. Now, how do I get out of here? Oh, it's right here. I for sure knew that. Now before we get out of here, check this out. We can even spawn a helicopter on top of this place. Since I'm here, I'll get one. Look at that. It's all camouflage and stuff. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put this baby in its rightful place. This ain't the place to park a helicopter. That place is actually more to that side. Okay, we're almost to the helicopter garage, and there we go. Now everything is in its right place. The next safe we're gonna look into is from this house. This is one of the premium houses, so its safe is pretty hidden. At least I think so. The safe of this house is hidden in this bathroom on the second floor. Let's just take a little shower before anything else. Just kidding. That's not why we're here. We're gonna squeeze into this wall because it has a secret passage. Yes, the safe is right here. Just gonna grab my money right here and run as if it wasn't mine. Our next one is in this little home right here. There's not a lot to say about this one since its safe is not hidden at all. You just gotta go upstairs. Not to this bed, but to the other one where you'll find a safe easy for the picking. And that's just a fairly easy little stealing mission. This place is really small, so it makes sense to not have something more elaborate. Now we're gonna be looking into this one. We gotta go upstairs right where this bedroom is. Now here's the sitch. This one actually is downstairs. Its safe is really unprotected as well. It's just sitting there ready for the stealing. So we can be easily done with this place's money. Next up is this modern looking house here. Looking inside you can see how modern and full of nature this place looks. But that isn't what we're looking for. And the safe of this place is pretty hidden too. Just like before we're gonna have a little shower. But you know that's a lie. If we click right at the shower head, this entrance will open up for us with a ladder. And of course, our humble little safe. This one is kinda hidden for sure. 
but not really complicated to get. To get out, we just need to click this button and climb up the ladder. Our next contender is here at this yellow house. Let's get inside. But I'll have to tell you, this place is full of mysteries. To start off in the library downstairs, there's a secret bookshelf door, of course, which leads to this weird pillar room with a bunch of chairs and this red book sitting ominously on the table. For this secret, we're gonna have to get a notebook from our inventory. Now we're gonna hold it and sit on one of these chairs for a bit, and then another, and then the other, and then in the last one. After that, we're gonna wait for it to become red, you can see that it's green right now and soon it'll turn to what we need. There, now we're gonna be able to find this secret glowing button that is gonna open up a secret passage in this corner and now we're in this really secret room. Let's even grab a flashlight. This is too dark. In this place, we'll only find a notebook and a chair. On the screen, there's a message that I'll translate to you. I didn't know it at the beginning. They came when I was a child. I am completely confused about what any of this is about. But for sure, this is pretty macabre. It even has a photo of someone that is probably missing on Brookhaven. Below him, it's written property of the FBI. He must have been from the FBI. Let's get out of this place. It freaks me out. I still didn't show you guys where the safe of this place is. And that's because, to my knowledge, there isn't a safe in this place. I smashed my face into all of this house and couldn't find anything. But that's not true. There's a place that I still haven't searched. And for that I'm gonna need a ladder and even a bed as well. Now we're gonna have to go on top of this house. And that's not gonna be an easy thing. Even if we put the ladder here, we can't get to it, but I actually have an idea for this. We just gotta go to the police station, go upstairs and make use of their own helicopter. And yes, this is my solution, a helicopter. Okay, we're almost there. Just gotta jump. Awesome, we did it. Now, we're gonna have to find a way to get into this roof. My logic is that it must be inside this top part since it's the only place I couldn't search before. Will this bed work? Doesn't look like it. What if we put it right here? We just gotta place it properly like that. And by what it looks like, this place doesn't have anything in here. Now I'm also sure it doesn't exist. So yeah, until someone proves me wrong, this is the only house in Brookhaven without its own safe full of money. Where will the safe be in this next house? To be honest, in a very simple place, this house doesn't have a hidden safe at all. We just gotta go to this room upstairs, and there we go. Grab the money and run away as if this wasn't my own money. Next up, we're gonna see what this place hides. I'm sad to say that it doesn't hide much. We just gotta go up the elevator. Okay, not that much. On this floor, we just gotta find our closet, and it'll be right here. I gotta find a better way to hide my money from myself. Our next one is in this lovely treehouse. We gotta climb this whole ladder. And by the way, this is the only treehouse in all of Brookhaven. I think this is actually one of my favorites. Right at this master bedroom, we'll find the safe near the bed. Not hidden at all. So we don't have to think much before robbing the players that have this place. Now we're gonna look into this brick house right here. We gotta get into it and go upstairs and... If I'm not mistaken, we gotta get into this room and right at this door to the right, there will be a little closet and right in front of it, a safe full of money. Another one of those easy pickings we talked about before. The next safe we'll find in this bunker. As we get into it, we'll go towards the elevator. By the way, this place looks so damn pretty. Now, the strat to getting this safe is to make ourselves as small as we can. After that, we're gonna come here to this living room with the TV and all that. We're not gonna watch some YouTube. We're gonna jump behind it and click this orange button right there. As we do that, we'll find this ladder where there's a bunch of stuff. But this isn't the place where the safe is. There's still a lot of money though. Gold bars and explosives. But let me actually show you where it is. This safe is close to this living room. But instead of going to that side, we'll go towards this bedroom and it'll be right at this room's closet. Apparently a closet is a pretty fair shot if you're ever looking for hidden safes. But that's all. It was still easy to get the money. Let's continue looking with this house here. We just gotta continue upstairs as this safe is actually pretty simple to find. We get into this bedroom, then it's bathroom and into this door inside of it we'll find their safe. So yes. Not that hard at all to find. Let's enjoy the opportunity and get some time at the jacuzzi. Very relaxing. With all this money in my hand. This is the next house we'll be looking into. It's easy. 
You just go upstairs, and as you turn, you'll be face to face with this not hidden at all safe. No problem at all. Next up, this lovely house right here. We'll have to go inside through their yard. Go upstairs and turn to our left, and that's just where it is. Another easy money for my fellow thieves. We're gonna look into another one of these modern houses. No problem at all. Just gotta go upstairs and turn to the left. Then you'll find it safe and sound. Well, not anymore. I stole it all. Now we'll be looking for it in this spooky house. I feel like this is the scariest house in all of Brookhaven. I'm even gonna change the lights so it's less bizarre. But it's safe isn't as spooky as the house. It's just in this bedroom upstairs. And that's it. We got the spooky money. But there's actually some little secret hidden inside this house. If we go to that same bedroom where we found the safe, there's a secret passage. Then we go inside of this and we'll see this weird room down here. Let's grab our flashlight so we can see anything. In this secret room, we can find two chairs, an X or maybe a cross on the ground. There's this broken mirror looking thing on the wall and also a black book next to a paper from the agency. What intrigues me are the chairs. Did someone live beneath these people's beds? I don't even want to know, as I want to be able to sleep tonight. Apparently, there's even one on this trailer house, but it's also a small house, so the safe is really easy to find as you can see. Nothing to worry about. By the way, this bedroom is actually really pretty. The view from the windows gives it a nice touch. Next up, we got another brick house. Inside of it, you can see that it is a more rustic design. We just gotta go upstairs and get on top of these railings. From here, we gotta jump up and walk between these fairly small beams. You just gotta be careful not to. I was gonna say be careful not to fall. At the end of it, we'll find all these crates where there's even a little security camera. Probably to watch if someone steals this safe right here. But it looks like the camera didn't help right now. Now we'll take a look at this building here. Focusing on the building. As this isn't really a house. It's more of a store of some kind. It's safe is hidden up the stairs. And I'll already say right now that this is a well hidden one. For us to find it we gotta jump on top of this frame. And then jump again to get into this secret room. Let's grab the flashlight. Since this place is pretty dark. In here we'll find these beds on the the ground one looks to be for an adult one for a child that's bizarre next to it is this thing on the ground that kind of resembles a crown there's also this table with some papers thrown around with a bunch of chairs beside it this is so weird who has a reunion in the attic there are some boxes and then of course our little safe is waiting for us our next safe will be finding in this one that I think it's the tallest house in all of Brookhaven. We just gotta go inside and climb up some of these stairs. Again! And finally we are right where the safe is. Not hidden at all. But here is where it stands. The next contestant will be this house right here. Also an easy one. We just gotta go upstairs to this room and there it will be. By the way, there's a secret here that you guys may not know. That we can go through this wall here. We can even see behind the safe in here. But there's not much to do with it. Let's just get out of here. Next up is this nice little wooden house. Emphasis on the little. It's a really small place. For the safe, you just gotta enter the bedroom and we already have the money. By the way, the safe of this house has a different coloration. It's not black like the others. It's green and blue. And it is pretty dirty. This is a more humble place. A TV on top of boxes. The house itself feels pretty crooked needs some work but it doesn't stop it from being a very cool house the next safe is in this house here this house is a very naturey kind of place a lot of plants in the yard very cool but its safe is actually pretty well hidden you're not gonna find it in your room or closet nothing like that for its safe you gotta go to the front of the house in the water yes literally right here and in it we find a secret passage right here we're gonna find a very weird place and the safe is hidden inside one of these walls so we'll be walking into these walls until we find a false wall there we go i think i found what we were looking for it's the safe now we can get the money so that's where the safe of this house is we're gonna look at this house here it's safe isn't really hidden and by the way, something different that it does is have this statue. But what we care about is the safe. This safe is right up both these stairs. And we're gonna find it next to the bed. Yeah, 
This one is another easy one. The next contestant is this house here. You're gonna want to go inside and climb up the stairs. Very easy to find. Exposed in the middle of the bedroom. Let's just get our money and bounce. Now we're gonna look at this house here. It's the most creative take on a Brookhaven house. Every one of its hallways are crooked. All of the house. It's very weird. Look at all these rooms turn to the side. But if I'm not mistaken, the safe is up here near the bathroom. You enter this door and there we go. Exactly in the closet. Let's go. Our next safe is in this incredible space rocket. Let's have a look inside. And down there doesn't seem to have anything. So I don't think we have to look at that part. We can just open up the door. We can go up this ladder. And then that one. And we'll be in this very weird place. Where we'll have to go up another ladder. Another thing that you didn't know about this rocket is that there's a secret room inside of it. Now we're in the control room. And if we jump up here, we're gonna find a secret passage. There's a ladder for you to climb. And we'll simply be in this room where it should be something like the rocket's core or something like that. And it keeps making these particles that I've never seen around Brookhaven. It's pretty cool. Now you're thinking, where is the safe? Well, this rocket doesn't have a safe. I've searched around all of this place and I couldn't find anything. So until proven wrong, this is one of the houses that don't have a safe. Well, it's not really a house, right? Now we'll be taking a look at this house. Simply gotta get inside and go up the stairs that it's hard not to see it's safe in this wall right here. Not any secret in this place. So this is the next place we're gonna see. Now this place hides a very bizarre secret. We just need to go upstairs and look at the ceiling. If we click up here, it's gonna drop an elevator and we'll go up here. And here we'll find their hidden safe. So we'll be able to take all of this money for ourselves. The weirdest thing is that we can find this item that's hidden right here. We can pick it up and it looks like some glowing claws. This one is very weird. Our next contestant will be this place over here. Let's go inside and go up these stairs. If I'm not mistaken, it is right in this master bedroom. From here you go to the bathroom, then the closet, and it's right here. What we're getting here is that almost everyone in Brookhaven keeps their money in the closet. Next up is this modern one here. The coolest thing about this house is that it has cars inside of it. It's kind of weird, but I like it. Now this safe is pretty hidden. We will have to go upstairs to the master bedroom with this car bed and race flags. And if we go up to this picture and click on it, it'll open a secret entrance that brings us straight to the safe with all that money we want. Let's have a look at this one. Not much of a secret to find here. You just have to go up the elevator to the first floor and you'll see it in this bedroom right here. So that's another easy target. Next, we'll be seeing this place is safe. We gotta open this fence gate. Go upstairs, not only outside, but inside. It's also not a hidden one. Right at this bedroom on the top floor, you'll find it sitting there on the wall. No problem to get it all. Now, something that this house has that no other has is an indoor slide. We can just go straight down fairly quickly. We'll have to show the safe of this fun house here. This is like a whole toy house. Something more kid-centric. So let's make ourselves smaller. Since it's one of the things we have to do to get it. There's a secret passage between these toys. Right near that blue tunnel we'll find a secret entrance to this blue room that is where we'll find the safe. I feel like that's pretty hidden. Next up we'll be taking a look at this house. For this one, we just have to go up this elevator. Remember what we said before. When in doubt, search the closet and you'll find that money. Now we are gonna get this new house a safe. I call this one new because it has been added in the last two months. For this one, we have to go up the elevator and then to the bathroom. It looks normal enough. Not much to see. But if we click on this mirror right here, it'll open up the wall where the safe is hidden. A very simple but nicely hidden one. What about this submarine? Well, it's kind of a house too. It's a pretty hidden one at that. We have to go downstairs to this sort of storage looking room full of boxes. If we go behind these boxes, we'll find a secret entrance into their very own safe room. It may look easy. But those that don't know it will have a hard time finding it. This one has been added recently, so I'll be showing where its safe is. We have to go up through its elevator to its last floor. And it may look difficult, but it's pretty simple. We just have to click on this plant and it'll open this wall up so we can get all that money. And to get out, you just have to click the glowing green button and we're out of here. Now our next segment will be the safes of the mansions. First off, we're gonna take a look at this lovely giant mansion. Just by its size, Players have had a hard time finding it safe. 
But it's fairly easy. We gotta go downstairs to this checkered floor. Right here at its indoor gym, it'll have a secret entrance in the wall. We'll have to use our bed trick for this one to work. Just like that. After you do that, you'll have to click this button inside the wall. And then you'll open up the secret safe room. After that, you just have to click it again and leave with all your money. Next up, we'll be having a look at this building. It's not really a house or mansion, but more of a prison, like a max security prison. Just look at how big this place is. I think it has more than 12 cells here. Oh look, 12. I guess I'm just that good. Now for the safe, we'll have to enter this employee's only door from the outside. There will be some gym equipment, and then just the safe sitting right there. Not really that secure for a prison. Our next contestant is this lovely place here. Look at how pretty this place looks. But if I'm not mistaken, you have jump up here for the safe. You'll drop into a secret room where you'll find it right here. It was pretty easy, but to be honest, I already knew where it was. Oh! They have guns here. Let's get out of here. We'll be taking a look at this mansion next. This one's pretty easy to find. You first have to find this room right here. Then you just click up there so an elevator will drop. It'll take you up into the hidden safe room and you can then just get out with all the money you got. And last but not least, this lovely hotel right here. This one has just been added in this new update. Now... For us to find this one, we'll have to make ourselves very small. The safe is right here in this elevator. You have to go up and then down a floor, and then you'll be able to go through this entrance. So here's the location of the new safe added to Brookhaven in this huge hotel. Now for us to get out, we just have to click on this glowing button. And that's it for now. So guys, hope you enjoyed it. You can safely click on one of these videos. They are the bomb. Please leave a like and comment below what was your favorite safe location, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more stuff just like this. Have a good one!